everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kellen Harp and today's video, I'm gonna try and keep it a bit shorter. I always say that and then it ends up being really long. It just depends how long I talk about everything. video from the title you could probably guess I'm gonna be going through my things that I had for Christmas and if I end up spending like five minutes on every item like talking about them we're gonna be here a long time <laughs> let's um, just get started as soon as possible I suppose I'm just going to address the fact that I really don't mean to brag when I show off what I had for Christmas I've been really spoiled and I'm so, so grateful for all the products, products. <laughs> I'm so, so grateful for everything that I've been bought and I just don't want anyone to feel like, eee, horror. you know, it's one of those things. I just don't want anyone to feel like I'm showing off or anything. But you guys voted to see this video on my Instagram and I hope you enjoy it. If you're interested in voting in polls in the future, they're always on my Instagram. So make sure to check out my Instagram. The link will be down in the description below. And I think we should just get started, just start opening stuff. Again, I'm gonna try and get through everything, like just a little word about each thing, who it was from, what I like about it, have I used it, blah, blah, blah. For most of my stuff um, that I've had for Christmas, I'm filming this like, what date is it today? The 7th of January. So I'm filming this almost two weeks after Christmas. Not, not quite two weeks, but almost two weeks after Christmas. And all the things, I've had to keep like 90% of my products in bags just so that I can film this video. I just haven't had a minute to film. And I had a week off. I'm sorry there was no video last week, but I'm back. <laughs> sorry, that took a while. But let's just get started. I'm gonna start unboxing some stuff and showing you what I had and who they were from. Um, yeah, so first thing. I'm gonna start with this. I've got like a box full of little goodies. I think this mostly had stocking presents in it off my mum. So there's one item that I've already used for a TikTok video. I had Posca pens off my mum. I needed these. I've only got like, I've got four Posca pens and they're the basics. So I've got like a black, a white, and then a silver and a gold. And my mum got me like all the colors. And like these ones, these ones are the fine tip ones, which is so good. It means that they're more precise. And I really wanted black and white in the fine precision ones too. So those were a great gift. Thanks mum. Next thing were some chocolate sprouts. I've been looking at these in the shop all year. All year? <laughs> all month, I suppose. And my mum put them in my, well, Santa put them in my stocking. Okay, next thing. Ooh, I got this really nice candle. So this is Mason Blanche. Is that how you say it? I'm not sure. Um, this is in, I almost said shade, in Tokyo. And it smells so nice. In fact, I'm gonna put this here somewhere. Where should it go? Nice. The next thing I got, oh, I've got a few baubles and I'm used decorative baubles on our presents this year. So I've got lots of those. And I also have this key ornament. This is very, keys are very sentimental to me and mum. We always like have a link to Dumbo and like being able to fly and stuff. It's very cute and we sort of like keep that going. She always gets me keys or something related. So I need to hang this up somewhere. We thought it might have been a Christmas ornament, but I think it's gonna be something that I put up all year. So on my Christmas list, I very kindly asked my mum for makeup storage because all my makeup sort of like scattered in different makeup bags and things. So I asked for something to just store all my makeup. So my mum got me this, which is amazing. It opens, I'm not gonna really be able to show you, but it opens and then it has like these little drawers that unfold and I'm able to organize all my makeup and then it has a large compartment and while we're here my mum also got me the Jeffree Star concealer and this is in the shade C2 it's perfect I always go for the almost white shade because um, my foundation is very pale anyway, so to make this like glowy effect, I always have to go for a really light shade. So mum got me that for Christmas and I'm really, I really love it. I use it every day. It's so, so good. Sorry, I'm continuously brushing my hair because I didn't style it today. So we're just going for this like wild look. And I also got, thinking about it, this was also a stocking present. This, which is so cute. It's like, oops, I forget, it's broken. But it looks like an ornament and it's in a little triangle and it's a beauty blender. So inside here is a little, wait, I'm just gonna move this box. In here, there's like a little beauty blender by the brand Beauty Blender, which I've never actually had. I've always used Real Technique or just like Primark ones. And there is a little really cute um, beauty blender in here. 
and it's just so cute. It's so soft. I'm really looking forward to using it, but I've got a few beauty blenders on the go at the moment, so I'm just saving it. But it also came with this little gem soap. It says on there, um, one um, blender cleanser, solid gemstone cleanser. And I'm assuming this is to wash the sponge, but I'm not sure. I wasn't sure if it was like a makeup cleanser. If you guys know, please let me know in the comments below because I don't know, I could probably find out, but I haven't researched it yet. Okay, quickly moving on to the next thing. Um, the first thing I can see on the floor here is this, um, I don't know what you call it. <laughs> this was off my boyfriend. It's like a little mixing desk for recording. So um, if you haven't already, I've recorded a Frozen cover on this channel, which I will insert up here and in the description down below, if you haven't seen it already. And um, I just need some like more mics. I've currently got a mic, but Will has bought me this awesome de like mini mixing desk and a new mic. So this is the mic, it comes in a little baggy. Again, I've always been recording, but I'm not super knowledgeable on how amazing everything is, but Will got me another mic so I can do like multiple recordings and also to change like, mix it up a little bit. I'm so grateful, it's so cool. Um, I can't wait to try it. I haven't tried like any of this new stuff yet. Like I said, I kept a lot of it in the boxes. So I'm really looking forward to using this. And I'm just so grateful, thanks Will. So the next thing that I got was off my auntie. This was a gift for me and Will. And she made us, um, it's not in this box, so I put it in the fridge, but she made us some jam. And she also got us this little toast holder. I feel like a mum with all this stuff now, and I've got like a house, and I can like make toast in the morning and put it in all these slots. This is so exciting to me. It's just the stuff that you don't think of buying yourself, but then when you have it, you're like, this is great. So I've got this, and she also, whoo, she also got us a little butter tub. I'm not sure what you call this, a butter, it's usually like a dish, but this one's like a tub, bowl, boat, and I currently don't buy like blocks of butter, but Will's parents have always used blocks of butter, and I thought one day we will probably use this to put butter in, and I just think it's really cute. So the next thing I got was off my nan. I asked her for this for Christmas, and so she got it for me. Um, basically, I go to the gym most days, and I've had the same trainers for quite a while now and I wore them throughout uni and I just fancied a new pair of trainers to wear to the gym but since receiving these these seem way too nice to wear to the gym like they're super super cool and so I'm going to show you so these are some adidas I think they're tubulars my old pairs were tubulars it says adidas profair <laughs> um wait it might say on the box yeah profair they're in a size five, they're like this really nice turquoise and they have these really chunky, bumpy soles and they are just so cool. They're like really, they're quite heavy for a trainer. Like I just, the details, I'm so excited about these. Haven't worn them yet, looking forward to wearing them. Do I wear them to the gym or do I wear them like casually? Don't know, but they're so nice. So happy with them. Thanks, Nan. Okay, so the next item I had off Will's parents um, I actually put this on my Christmas list, so I ended up getting a, like a double, but of like a different type. But this is a little makeup bag. It's the Morphe. I've actually used it because I just couldn't wait. I've been, I had to wash my current makeup brushes, so I ended up getting some more. Ooh, spoiler, these are makeup brushes. These are the Morphe um, collaboration with Manny MUA. And there's a bunch of brushes in here. So they're all still in the packaging because I'm crazy and I want to keep all the packaging. But there's like <laughs> so many to choose from. This is an, oop, my hair is all over it. Um, but like you can see there's like a variety, oop, I dropped that one. There's a variety of eyeshadow brushes, like little um, blending ones and they vary in sizes. I've been using this one for my highlighter, but you know. But anyway, that was so lovely and I'm so happy because even though I got doubles, you know, you always need makeup brushes and you're traveling and and stuff and they were just so kind and so I've just all oh, I've been using the same like two eyeshadow brushes for the longest time so it's just amazing to have like a huge collection I'm so great I'm just thank you <laughs> okay so the next item was off my so my brother and his wife and his kids this is some earmuffs and a little travel mug um, I've needed a travel mug for ages I've got a thermal one but I haven't got like one of these like 
you know the ones that you just chuck in a tea they don't stay warm but they're just to like like will and i always go on drives and it's like quick make a cup of tea so that's so handy and it's really cute i've not actually well i've seen loads of earmuffs in pre-mark lately and i've been so tempted i don't know whether i can rock them shall we find out i'm actually gonna open this right now okay so here are the earmuffs should i try these Ooh. <laughs> they're cute i don't know if i can rock these or if i look like a muffin <laughs> <laughs> but they're cute. I bet they really it sounds so stupid. I don't think I've worn earmuffs since I was little But they're cute <laughs> So the next item I got were these bath bombs I don't actually know how many's in here, but it's like a nice box. This is from the brand Secret squirrel or is that the type of boxes? Oh, no, it's from Bo bomb cosmetics I think secret squirrels the box but it's got like this little booklet and I think it tells you how many is in here or the ones that you could get. So I'm really excited to open this. Um, it does actually say what they are on the back, but I'm not gonna open this right now, but um, I'm gonna definitely be using these in my bath. Oh, the next item, I keep forgetting about this one, was this backpack. I had this back, not this backpack, I had another backpack for uni. Well, I think I had it through sixth form actually, so I've had it at least three or four years. And I wore it all the way through uni, I loved it. And then it started to like rust at the, the zips and also one of the zips broke. So I asked my dad for a bag for Christmas and I ended up picking this one out because he wasn't sure which one to get. But it's amazing, it has so many compartments. It has like a laptop bit. And it's also got one of my favorite things is this key. Like, I'm gonna sneeze. <laughs> Bless me! <laughs> so it has like this key thing and I'm so rubbish like I'll chuck my keys in loose in my bag and then I can't find them so that's great. It's also got lots of these like compartments for your phone, spare change, oh it's just the best. So nice! While I'm thinking about it these things aren't physical but my boyfriend also got me Planet Zoo um, for the PC and I'm addicted to it and he also got me the Untitled Goose Game on my Switch and I've actually completed it apart from they've added a few extra um, objectives but other than that I've completed it but it's so fun because before Christmas it was released and I like loads of YouTubers were playing it and I resisted pl watching them because I really wanted to play it for myself and then he bought it for me so yeah that's what else I got oh I also got a second backpack this is an Osprey one this is for like walking and stuff so when I go to Harrogate we often do like little walks and um, we just enjoy it with his family. And I thought this backpack would be great because I can just like chuck my drink in there, a jacket, whatever, you know, like depending on the weather, these backpacks are just great. And it's lightweight, it's water resistant, it's got a little water cover as well, it has little pockets for your drinks. I don't know, it's just really great. I haven't actually used it yet. Well, I haven't used a lot of these things, but I'm really looking forward for an excuse to using this. What's this? It's like a little, I assume this is similar to a key holder again so yeah i got that too okay so the next thing i got oh since i was talking about earlier the morphe brushes i also got this large morphe brush collection off my mum and um it has so many different to the manny mua collection but has like a larger variety but it's just because it's a bigger brush collection but it has so many eyeshadow brushes they, they're all still in the packaging because i'm a weirdo and i haven't used them yet but look at this huge one whoa there's just so many like i've never had this many brushes to work with and it's really exciting me about what i can do and what i can experiment with so that's really nice i'm so grateful for this this is the like the one thing that i really really wanted and i'm just so happy and i'm really grateful that i actually got two because it means that I can, if one brush is dirty, you have another, you know, it's great. I'm gonna try and pick all of these out at once because I got them off different people, but, um, th and I'm gonna just try and show them in a bulk, but, sorry, I'm just trying to reach for them. But I got a bunch of Gymshark clothes. Like I said earlier, I go to the gym a lot, so this was one of my main wish list presents. So I'm just gonna quickly dash through everything that I got. Um, I got these awesome, like, what is this, the flex ones? I'm not sure. But I got these Gymshark leggings. These are in the shade Sand, I think. But they're like a khaki sort of greeny, beigey colour. 
and these are the leggings they're not the short ones they are the long leg ones and I'm a bit short for these they're always a bit long and I have to roll them up but these look so flattering on so yeah I got these leggings and I also got to go with those the matching bra oops it's inside out so I've got a nice set to wear to the gym I already have this in pink the matching bottoms and tops so I have the same ones but in a bright pink but I really wear them but it's only because they're pink and I'm not sure that pink's my colour. I also got a second set which were in this these I don't know oh, there's someone at the door one sec well I'm back <laughs> someone just came to the door about a pest like he was a pest control apparently the flat upstairs has mice <laughs> so he came to check the kitchen to see if we had mice we don't uh, by the looks of things but that's still a bit concerning but anyway back to the video so I think I was on the red um I don't know what kind these are I've never had this type from Gymshark before but they were really really reduced in the sale and they are stunning like on this so so nice I forget who got me which my nan got me two sets and my mum got me one set these red ones and they have these panel it this paneling on them and they have a nice these are all high-waisted and it's so so flattering like they look so nice and I can't wait to wear them to the gym and I also got the matching Gymshark top it is a bra and it has support like it has pads but it's more of like a top and it's a lot longer like it comes a lower um, on your belly, if that makes sense. And then I got a third and final set, as well as an extra top. This one is amazing. The leggings are amazing, like so flattering. So I got this purple set. These are, um, I don't know, again, I don't know the type. Oh, here we are. These are the light seamless leggings um, in this purple. They have a really high waist band that's like tight. And then the, te the, the leggings are like a thick tight material, as in like tights that you wear with a skirt. And they are so soft and so flattering. So I got these leggings and then I got a matching top, but it's not a bra this time. It's um, inside out. <laughs> um, it's like um, a crop top that you would wear over your gym bra. It's in a matching purple. I'm showing you the wrong way because you can't see the Gymshark logo. <laughs> but it also has like a little pulley so you can like make it tighter around your belly. And it's just so nice. It's really light breathing, like breathable and just really nice. I'm so happy for it. And then finally I got this Gymshark top, um, crop top in gray with the blue band. Um, I think this is the flex. I keep forgetting, yeah, these are flex. I've already got the leggings to match, so this top was in the sale and I was like, that would be so good to get. So I got this. They also had like a maroony color one, um, but that one sold out like in a few seconds. So <laughs> I ended up getting this one um, to match my current leggings and I'm just really happy with it. So we're gonna move on to, I'm gonna quickly go through this few last bits in the bag and then we're almost done. So I got off my mum some Mickey Mouse pajamas. Um, I'm always in need of pajamas, so I've got these like checkered bottoms, and then it's got this top that's got Mickey Mouse on the front. It says Walt Disney Mickey Mouse and has four different Mickeys on it, and it says it all started with a mouse. And my mum love fell in love with the the little text on the back because when we went to Disneyland we were just discussing this and it's just really nice and I can't wait to wear these. I love pajamas so much. I also got two extra pairs of pajamas. I had a pair off my dad and off my nan from I think these are MS. Yes, and they're like a similar style, except these ones have stars and they're like a turquoisey color. And then these ones are like pink and gray and they have like seals and whales and stuff on the trousers. Again, pajamas are just a must. Very happy with these. And then the final thing in this bag are these lovely, lovely gloves that my nan knitted me. My nan also got me an Olaf plushie. He's in the bedroom. I can go and get him if you want. Should I go and get him? No, it's okay. But I also got like a big Olaf plushie off my nan. And I also had these gloves that she knitted for me. She knitted me some very similar, slightly smaller ones a few years ago. And as soon as I had them for Christmas, I wore them one day and I lost one. So I was sad about it. So she made me some more and I really loved them. So this was off my brother. Um, he got me this lovely Kath Kidston bulb. It looks like a bulb, but it's actually shower gel. So this is always handy, you know, it's one of those things, it's like an essential and then as soon as you run out, like I probably won't use this for a few weeks until we've run out of the shower gel that's currently in the shower, but I'm really looking forward to using that and I'm really grateful Kath Kidston is so nice. A few things I'm just going to mention as well that I received that um, aren't here 
um, because I put them away. My mum and my sister both got me hampers for Christmas, but they had like completely different things in them. So like my sister got me some risotto, I had biscuits for cra like crackers and biscuits, I had some rice. Yeah, so I had a hamper of my sister. Oh, and it also had tea in it. And yeah, just really nice. And then my mum's one, she also got me crackers, but it also had lots of other things like Darjeeling tea, lots of things. I can't even name everything, some wine. So that was really nice. Who doesn't love a hamper? It was just really, really nice. I've got a few more items to show you, and I think that, oh, my, my tripod just fell over. I've got um, a stocking off my boyfriend that I'm gonna show you. So I'm just gonna grab that. Got it. So in here, I've got, I've forgotten, you know. I've got Lotus Biscoff spread. This stuff is amazing. I'm gonna quickly try and get through this because we're gonna be here forever otherwise. Oh, this is my boyfriend's. I got this for my boyfriend. It's a toothbrush, like, holder. It's so silly. I did, like, silly stocking presents. Ooh, I've also got these Christmas Percy Pigs. Oh, they're open. I completely forgot. Cute! They're Percy Pigs with hats! Yay! Look at the Percy Pig in a hat! Oh, I'm out of focus. Mmm! Who so doesn't love Percy Pig? Sorry, I'm chewing now. I also got... Ooh, guitar strings. So good. My guitar I've had for years and years and I've never changed the script. The strings, which is a sin. So that was a really thoughtful gift. I also got... Ooh, a ukulele tuner. So, I've got a ukulele, but it's really, really, like, cheap. I love it, but it's just not very good. But my boyfriend bought me a new one, but it actually came damaged, so he's gonna so he's gonna return that ukulele, and he's actually ordered me another one, which I think is arriving tomorrow. I don't know what it's like, so keep an eye out on my Instagram again. That'll be linked in the description. I'll put that on my story for you guys to see. Sorry, I'm still eating this sweet. I also got mm, Caramac. Who doesn't love Caramac? I've never had the buttons but the chocolate bars are the best. They remind me of my childhood. I haven't had them in years. So very excited to try these. These aren't opened yet, but we have so many sweets and chocolates to get through. So it's gonna be a while. I also got some like Christmas chocolate. So in here there's like reindeer, Santas and little chocolate balls. Like I said, we have so many chocolates that I've got these sprouts as well. So excited though, I can't wait to eat them all. What else is in here? Oh, I think that's it for the stocking. So we got through the stocking. Some stuff I'm gonna quickly dash through that I put in this bag. So I also got this little key ring. It's a little tatty teddy that says, hugs and kisses. I had that off my boyfriend in my like stocking. And I also had, I put these in the front of my bag. He got me this little silly cactus pen, which is very, very cute. I love cactus, cacti. And I also had, these, he thought they were otters and we've got like a story with otters, but it is a bit, but they're little post-its and I just think they're so cute. Can you see? I'm gonna try and show you. Cute! So I keep my pen and my little post-its in my bag. Just the final few bits I'm gonna go grab and then I'll be back. I'm gonna start with two of my so silly but favorite presents. Um, so the story behind this one is we went to a garden center a few months ago with Will's family and there was like a little plushy section for children and I love plushies so much. And they had like little cute vegetable plushies and they had this pepper and he got it for me but he got it for me, I completely forgot about it. And then he went back and got it for me and it was in my stocking and I just love him. His name is Pickle, he's like, has beans on the inside but it's like squishy on the outside so it has this like really fascinating texture and he's just my best friend okay so another plushie i've been in love with these this brand of toy called squish marlows for ages never bought one because i have so many toys but my boyfriend went and got me one for christmas and he got me this elephant <laughs> look how this is my elephant. I love him so. Oh, I'm out of focus. I love him so. As you can tell, look, I have another elephant. I love elephants. But he is so soft, like a marshmallow. It gets it from the name. This little elephant is called Ginger. And she has a little bit of pen on her belly because when Will was wrapping her and wrote my name on her, he accidentally poked through the paper and got a little pen on her. But you know, it makes her unique. And she has a little green blob, and we love her for it. <laughs> so, yes. That. Okay, we're down to the last three items. So the next item is this bag that Will's grandma, her name is Nine, made for me. So she does patchwork and she made this, she makes lush blankets and throws and they're so beautiful. But she made me this lovely, lovely bag, which is in a similar style. It has, oh my gosh, I never know. <gasps> it's got holly on it. 
which is very seasonal, but that's my name. My name is Kellen and translates to Holly in English. Um, Kellen is Welsh for Holly. And she's put Kellen on it. Will's gonna be shocked. I'm gonna have to show him this and he's gonna be like, wow, that's so nice. You know, just a very thoughtful thing. I'm so, so this bag has been used multiple, multiple times. It's just like a little throw of a little bag and it has a little pocket and it just has all this beautiful patchwork. Sorry, this is, I'm talking about this bag so much, but it's just so beautiful. Can you imagine how much time she spent making this? It's just lovely and it has a lovely inside. Oh, just really, really thoughtful. I was so shocked when I saw this. I was like, that's so kind. And down to the last two items, I think. I can't think of anything else. I don't think I'm missing anything. I may have, but I don't think so. So the last one second to last product are these awesome, awesome, awesome vans. So I've wanted these forever. They're super, super trendy. Um, every When I was at uni, everyone was wearing these. As you can tell, I've worn these already. They have a little dirt on the toe, but I really want to keep them clean. But then I'm like walking like a penguin because I don't want to get them dirty, but they're so stunning. So happy with them. I have so many shoes, but I've just wanted these for the longest time and I'm so grateful. I had these off my dad and I'm just so grateful. They're so, so lovely, worth it. I love them. <laughs> Not gonna say anymore because we'll be here forever. And then to the final product, this was like, I was mind blown. I wasn't expecting it, was this new Apple watch. So this watch I had off my mum for Christmas and it has the Nike Sport strap on it, which is great because I go to the gym and one of the main reasons I, ooh, my watch is listening to me. One of the main reasons I use my watch is for like my training and going to the gym. I like to see how many steps I've done and you know, and like you can like put in, I can't believe it. Cause I used to have the series one watch and I can't believe how much it's upgraded. Like there's so many options. You've got like badminton, um, sword fighting. Like you can have anything on here, but I love so many features about like, I've got the mini mouse um, screen. I'm not sure if you can see, it's gonna be upside down. Oh, there you go. So I've got that Minnie Mouse, and if you tap her, she talks. She's not talking. Hello? Did I turn the sounds off or something? I put silent mode on. She's what? Oh, what? Good afternoon. Ah! But just so happy. Thank you so much, Mum. I just, I'm so, I'm shocked about this. I can't believe they got me this beautiful watch. I felt really guilty um, because it's just a lot of money. <laughs> but I use it every day and it's just one of the best things. I love, I used to wear a watch every day and then when I went to uni I was doing shows and I was taking it off for rehearsals and stuff. And so I stopped wearing a watch for a bit because I didn't need a watch. Um, but since wearing it, I feel naked without it now. It's really odd. But um, yeah, that's all of my presents. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching it. I hope this video isn't too long, but I hope you guys enjoyed watching me do this as much as I enjoyed like, re it's like reopening your presents because they've been here for like two weeks. I haven't really looked at anything. The only things I've like worn are my vans and I've had some sweets and stuff, but I haven't really seen anything. So it's just really nice to like see everything again. And yeah, it's just so nice. So I can put all this stuff away now. Finally, my house is not gonna be a mess. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this as much as I enjoyed filming it and just opening everything and like reminiscing of Christmas and it was just so nice. I hope you guys like this setup. It's more of a closer, more personal experience. Um, I just think it looks a little bit better. Let me know what you think um, down in the comments below. If you guys haven't already, make sure to like and subscribe. Make sure to click the notification bell because I'd love to see you again in the future. Just let me know down in the comments below if there's something specific you'd like to see me do. Um, in my last video, I unboxed a Jeffree Star thing. Um, what's it called? A mystery box. And I got the Blue Blood palette in that. And I think that'll be next week's video, uh, maybe testing that out. But if you guys have any other requests, anything, I don't know, put in all the lush bath bombs in my bath or something, anything. If there's anything you'd like to see me do, make sure to let me know down in the comments below because I love your suggestions and I want to make you guys enjoy the videos. If you haven't already, make sure to check out all my socials in the description down below. You can check out my Instagram, my Snapchat, my Twitter, my TikTok. And make sure to check out my TikTok, by the way, I'm posting every day. So if you're missing my face on here, I'll be over there. And I hope you guys just enjoyed. I don't know how many times I'm gonna say that, but I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you all in next week's video. Bye.